In the face of a ravaging pandemic, technology again comes to the rescue. The Federal Executive Council in a virtual meeting, a first in living memory and a fallout of the COVID-19 pandemic. A few ministers joined President Buhari and Vice President Yemil Shibajo in the council chambers, while others contributed from their offices. Ahead of deliberations, the Secretary to the Government of the Federation calls for silence in honor of former ministers who passed on, including the late Chief of Staff Malam Abakari. The Secretary to the Government then unveils the new Chief of Staff. His Excellency has approved the appointment of Professor Abola Abola Rahim Rahim Mari as his new Chief of Staff. Professor Gambari was part of the meeting which lasted two and a half hours. Well, I have not started, so I'll find out and let the, I don't report directly to the, to the nation, I report to the president. I think he demands loyalty, competence and support. The council approves the revised MTEF and 2020 budget estimates. The approval has these key parameters. The crude oil price is approved at $25 per barrel. Crude oil production is approved at 1.94 million barrels per day and then an exchange rate of 360 naira to 1 US dollar. Other approvals are for loans for agricultural mechanization and a facility for a Bonyi state. It's going to be a major revolution in the agricultural sector that have, we have never seen before. Uh, and I think uh, the executive council has done the right thing and has approved this. The Nigerian Ports Authority is to purchase 19 operational vehicles at over 600 million naira, while the Minister of Power got approval for 47 billion naira augmentation to boost power grid infrastructure. The last meeting of the Federal Executive Council before this virtual engagement was in March 2020. Ibrahim Adra, reporting for Channels Television News. Thank <laughs> you.